different for you guys something different than the normal um, we normally have like um, content that we're trying to come up with to entertain you guys and things that we just like to do things we enjoy doing and enjoy showing you um, but today I thought that we would just bring you guys along that way you don't miss out on another week of video so I didn't record last week because I have been so so busy at work so we might as well just bring you guys along. Yeah. So we're back. This is my grooming shop. This is where I am all week. This is what I do. This is Gracie. Say hi. Gracie's gonna get a bath. trimming here and there. Her daddy really likes her to be fluffy and fuzzy. So she's done. Now she gets to pick out a really cute bow tie. Which one do you want, Gracie? You like the pink one with the polka dots or the tie dye? Let's see. Or purple? Purple looks good on you. I don't know. I like the pink with the polka dots, Gracie. All right, Gracie's all done. How do you guys like her finished look? Gracie! She's a pretty old girl. So this is Bridget. She's really old and she had a stroke, is what her mama just told me, um, a couple of weeks ago. So um, she's doing better now. She's an old lady and she just came in for a nail trim. So I'm gonna bring her, trim her nails on the floor. This is called a Dremel and it files her nails so that they're smooth and it gets them shorter and rounder. She's doing a good job. You're a good girl, Bridget. So that didn't take too long. Now her nails are nice and short and she can go home. Are you happy, Bridget? Bridget, are you a happy girl? Yeah, look at that old face. Just to let you guys know what I was using, I was using this little Dremel, very small, compact, um, and no, it does not hurt the dogs as long as you know what you're doing. Um, so yeah. Eugene, good boy. This is Eugene. He's a golden doodle. And he's here for a full groom. He's a big boy. And he's so sweet. a little bit so now I'm going to put some leave-in conditioner on him I'm gonna do it all over his body where everything's long um, rub it in let him sit for a couple of minutes got his bath and his blow dry say hi boys all right now we're gonna start brushing him out and get started on his haircut yeah tell him I 
I'm gonna be pretty. <laughs> By the way, this is my view. Of the swimming pool. That's okay. I am here with Eugene. With Eugene. Okay, so I finally got him all brushed out. He's had his bath, all that good stuff. So now we're gonna go ahead and finish up his room. You ready? You ready to be done? Ready? Okay, here's the finished Eugene. He looks so handsome. He's so happy. He has a cute bow tie. Yeah, you get to go home now. Okay. A cute little bow tie. Let's see your bow tie. <laughs> he's he knows he's done, so he's ready to get down. The finished Eugene. He barks every time. Look at your bow tie. <laughs> I think it's a little too tiny. He's got some big old fluffy legs. His mama, his mama likes his legs fluffy. I can't talk when you're talking. So I really hope that she likes it. I know. She, your mommy is on the way, okay? All right, guys. So I'm back home and my phone died. Um for my last dog of the day, so you didn't get to see that. But I do hope that you enjoyed seeing all the other dogs that I groomed today. We try to post on Mondays and Tuesdays, but sometimes that doesn't always go as planned. But we do post once a week or twice weekly. However, I did not post last week because, like I said at the beginning of the video, I was just, I was so busy. Another grooming shop in town had actually closed down. So I was taking some of their clients too. It was just a really, really busy time for me. So anyway, I brought you guys with me today. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, also disclaimer, I am a professional dog groomer. So I do have my own shop at my grandparents' house, but I have been grooming dogs since 2011. And before that, I started uh, working with dogs at a veterinarian hospital. So that's where I actually uh, discovered like how much I actually enjoy working with dogs. So then in 2011, I actually became a dog groomer and I groomed for a, um, some other people. And then I decided that working from home actually works out better for me. Just for every reason, I could go on and on, just a huge list of reasons why working at home works out for me. Number one reason is I have kids. So the kids can come with me during the summer, they can play in the pool, they can hang out at grandma's house while I groom at grandma's house, obviously. So it's just, it's way easier for me and my clients love it because I do get to groom one dog at a time, so that's awesome. And the dogs love it. So it's not stressful on them. Um, my grandpa worked really hard on making that little shot for me. So yeah, I love it. Um, anyway, uh, if you like this video, please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. And also be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that every time that we post, you will be notified so that you, you know, don't miss out on a video as soon as we post it. Also, I wanna go ahead and let you know um, that we will be giving out $50 once we hit 50 subscribers. So once we hit 50 subscribers, I will be checking our comments and whoever has posted their email address, we will randomly pick a winner and, um, yeah, you'll receive 50 bucks. So who doesn't want to do that? So help us get to 50 subscribers. That's like our little goal right now. We're at 41 right now. So please be sure to comment your email address down below. If you don't comment your email address, then we won't be able to give out 50 bucks. So help us help you. I think that's all I've got to say today. I feel like I'm missing something, but 
anyway um i hope you like this video bye guys peace